So I promise you that I will make a part two to what was on the thumb drive that I found inside the mystery box from the dark web. There have been a lot of comments since the original upload last night. However, we did record this video a few days ago. We found some things inside the box that were very disturbing. And I can say this, the contents of that package are no longer in my possession. I did what I found appropriate with them. However, I did continue rolling footage after we finished opening up that box the other night. And I did record the footage of what was on the thumb drive. There we go. We're recording now. <sighs> yeah, alright, so now that we're recording, um, Brie went ahead, she left for the evening, and I just kinda put some stuff back away. I put everything that was related to children, the clothing, the backpack, the books, everything, the pictures, all inside the cardboard box, and I put those two dolls back inside the chest because that's where they came out of initially and I mean I don't know a lot about superstitions but either way I feel like they should just stay where they were I don't really want it in my possession and I I have a very sick feeling in my stomach from all the things that we just took out of this package and I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to really like sense what we just went through she didn't want to see what was on this thumb drive I'm kind of nervous to open it up I don't know whether or not this is like gonna be something like gruesome or, or morbid or or having to do with children I mean most of the stuff inside this box had to do with kids and I feel kind of sick but what we're gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to turn this camera off but I'm gonna leave this one on all right so let's go downstairs set this up and let's take a look at what's on this thumb drive Alright guys, so now I have the camera set up. This is the clearest that I'm going to be able to get it without getting in the way of the monitor. I got my microphone, I got my head cam rolling. And the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to disconnect the internet. I don't know what's on this, but whatever is on this, I don't want the internet being on or this being traced or anything like that. Okay, good. There is no internet connection. I'm actually kind of nervous about putting this in my computer. Here we go. My hands are actually like a little bit shaky right now because I don't want to be doing this at the moment. All right, so. Okay. So the thumb drive itself is titled Enjoy. And it looks like there's only one thing on the thumb drive, which is a MP4 file. And it says, we all eat. So this is a video, guys. And depending what's on this, I might have to censor it if it's anything like gruesome that I can't show on the channel. And if, I, if it's anything to do with like child porn or anything sick like that, I'm going to turn it off immediately. With that being said, let's hit play and see what we got. All right, you guys ready? What is that? What is that? All right, so there's definitely some gory stuff on here. Um, the video is titled, We All Eat. So it looks like the first scene, I'm going to go through it scene by scene, and I hope that the video capture is still recording so you guys could see this clearly. 
It looks like the first scene is like the woods somewhere. Um, and then it changes. Okay, and now it's like it's like a nanny cam or something, like a baby in a crib, or actually maybe two babies. It looks like there's another one up here. So it's like two babies in in crib side by side. That's really weird. And then it shows like out here again. It shows okay. So now it's showing the woods again, and it looks like rain. Maybe it's raining outside here. And then it shows the babies again. So it shows the woods, and then it shows two babies. All right, now this right here is fucking disgusting. I'm gonna have to censor some of this out. Uh, this is like a surgery of some sort. This is definitely, it looks like somebody being opened up. Um, it's like there's surgical scissors here pulling skin back inside of somebody's, it looks like maybe a stomach or something, but it looks hollowed out. And then this right here is like, oh God, I don't know. I mean, it looks like a surgical pan, like one of those pans that they would have inside the hospital. And there's like stuff being poured out into the surgical pan. And I'm, I'm assuming that's like some somebody's maybe somebody's insides possibly and then wait a minute what was that it looked like there was a flash like i saw something in the flash right here did you see that hold on what was that trying to pause it that's weird all right so then you could see it looks like out here like worms and, and slugs or something out here and there's like a, a pan right here so I don't know if this is the same pan that was in the last scene where it looked like somebody's remains were being poured into it's like okay you got like a surgery You've got like remains being poured into a pan and then you've got these worms, these disgusting like slugs everywhere. And honestly, like all of this is disgusting, first of all, but like, I don't know what that is right there, this. And if these are just like slugs, I gotta be honest, there's this right here is like a gigantic slug. So I'm assuming that maybe some of these are like overly large slugs. I don't know what they're feeding on, whatever's inside of that. And then you got maggots for like, for like 10 seconds. You got, not even 10 seconds, two seconds. You got some maggots and a beetle definitely on some bones. I'm trying to pause it. All right, there we go. Let's see. Is that a human bone? I don't know. I don't know if that's a human bone or an animal bone. I'm hoping that it's not a human bone and it is an animal bone and this is just some kind of sick joke. But, um, let me know what you guys think. Alright, so one more time, I'm gonna play it from start to finish for you guys. Let me know if there's anything you guys see in here that I didn't see that maybe could give some sort of a clue or a sign as to what the hell this means. I gotta know what that is. There's definitely something in, in between that static right there. So, let me... I'm probably gonna have to put this in my video editing software in order to slow it down so that I could see what that is. There's definitely an image being flashed uh, in between the static. I've really had enough for one night um, and, and I'm pretty creeped out. I mean, I'm not trying to sound like I am not sitting in the dark. We all eat. Uh, I just, I want to see what that is that's flashing. I, I could see it when the video plays, but I can't pause it. Right there. There's something there. Right there. Ooh, what is that? What is that? 
Oh, that's... That is... Creepy and disturbing. It's like a picture of an old woman... Biting a baby's head. I see like a child's arm right here. I don't know if this is actually a photograph or like a drawing. It's disgusting. I'm pretty sure that that's a sketch. That doesn't look like a real image. At least I hope it's not. It's like an Asian woman, I think. And it looks like she's biting a child's head. She's like holding a newborn in her hand. Alright guys, I'm, I'm done with this. So, I'm taking the thumb drive out. Alright, well, it looks like my head cam is turned off now. Uh, I think the battery just died on it. After watching it, it was one of those things that I kind of wish that I didn't watch. Opening up that box in the first place, I feel like was a mistake. I would highly recommend that anybody out there uh, who, who watches these videos for fun does not try to get on the dark web and order a mystery package. You don't know where this stuff is coming from, you don't know who this stuff is coming from, and you also don't know if they are going to have your personal information. So I would highly suggest not to do it, but I will say this. I have already done one, and it is getting a lot of views, and I see a lot of people leaving comments saying that they would like to see another one. I don't think that it's safe to order another one. I would prefer not to. We always try to make videos to make people feel good, and I feel like this video definitely didn't make people feel good. If anything, it was pretty much the opposite. It definitely didn't make me feel good making it, and I'm sure that it left a lot of people feeling uneasy. I was not prepared for that when we got the box. I didn't really know what to expect, but after opening it up, there was just so many weird things in there. Um, I had to do something about it. So until next time, I will catch you guys later. Thanks for joining.